and get off. I don't really think it's worth it, is it? Not bad for EV growth. Can you see me, Bob? Uh, we're watching Dean right now. You disappeared out of sight a long while ago, Tina. Hey, you just came into sight again, uh, Jack. Hey, let me enough room to deploy the heat flow. I'm going to. I'm looking for a place away from craters and rocks. That's why I didn't land up there. Flight EVA. Good. Hey, CDR is 20 minutes behind at the station. Okay, I think I got a place. And I think it'll also uh, give you a spot for the neutron flux that's sheltered from the RTG. Okay. You say you have a place like that, Jack? Well, I pretty much, I think, Bob. Okay. Let me work on it here a little more. Okay, and right now you're about 300. 10 minutes behind the yeah. timeline, Jack. Okay. Bob, I'm only going to spend another minute or two on the fender. We'll catch up. I never thought I'd be out here doing this. Right now. Well, I tell you. Yeah, yeah, we'll say about one more minute or something. Okay, I'm going to go back this way. Central Station can be near a crater. It'll be pretty good. That'll put the lean right out over there, which is probably all right. The perimeter out over there, which is probably all right. I'm going to put your drill holes a little too close to that rock, though. Bob, uh, ask Mark if he's worried about rocks as much as craters. Okay, stand I got by. a rock about two meters in diameter, partially buried. Can you copy that experiment? I copy flight. That uh, one of the probes may be near. Stand by. And define near. Well, it could be with. Ten feet. Slide it, okay. Slide out, definitely.